Well guys, we're back. Back on the booster. Uh, it's been a while, I know. You know how it goes. Sometimes you just don't have enough time to do all the things you wanted. But here we are anyway, we're back out. And uh, this is the replacement booster. I'm living with it. It's not as bad as on this one, but I think a lot of these newer type display ones are uh, suffering with it. So the problem is with the motor cogging. After it initially does that, then it stops doing it at all. It's only at slow speeds. I put BMX bars on here for a bit more rise. Um, what else have I done? I haven't done a hell of a lot. Oh no, I put these uh, CST 11 inch off road tyres on it. And now if you, <laughs> the mug guard doesn't cover it, but I need to do something with that eventually. Because uh, that doesn't do nothing. My back just gets completely sprayed with mud. Um, uh, I forgot my 360 degree case for my camera, so I can't put that on today. So you're not gonna get any wild shots out of me today. I don't know how many miles I've done since I've had this one. So I've only put 23 miles on this. It's not running too bad, as long as you're not always pulling off on it. Obviously I'd rather it not do it, and I do need to look into the problem why it's doing it. I don't think it's the motors. So I'm gonna have to investigate it at some point. Um, I barely get enough time as it is to do these videos, but I will start getting back into it. And hopefully giving you at least one video a week because I love making the videos and uh, I mean you guys seem to enjoy it as well so I'll show you what I mean with the cog in so dual motors okay see it's not doing it too bad there <laughs> it's not doing it now. See, it does it a little bit. But Jesus, does this thing fucking fly. We're on the same trail we was on on the very first M4 Pro video. So, uh, there's always lots of people on here. Ooh. Blasted the power and then I have to slow right back down again. But I like it down here, it's nice and fun. Thank you! Yeah. Now these off-road tyres, I would definitely recommend them. Because we're going to have some really shit weather for the next few months. Um, 20 quid a pop, but are they a bastard to put on? There's actually tricks to putting them on, but I struggled and I suffered and I swore. Whoa, up and road, let's go. 20. Now this isn't on full amps, it's still on the standard 12 because I don't want to blow the fence on the controllers like I did last time. Wow. You're welcome. Lovely, thank you very much. No, you're, uh, take your time, take your time. I'm here. I'm here. It's, 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 a, it's all right, it's all right. <laughs> Cheers. Now I'm loving these BMX bars, look at them. Such good fun. Bring the bars up so much higher. Feels a lot more stable with them. 
<laughs> you can't not have fun on this thing. It's a fun machine. It really is a lovely scooter. Once it's going, oh God, look at this. Go slow through it. Oh fuck me! It's all the way down there. Do you reckon I should be on the mud or on this? Ah, oh, I've got to come back through this as well. Damn it! I'll have to. It's like a stream. See, can you hear it? Oh, hold on, I need to tighten this stem off a bit. It likes to work itself loose, this bugger. There we go. This, uh, this little bit. I ain't got no cracks in the stem, look. There we go, look, see? See, I'm just going to use this as a messing around scooter. I don't mind getting dirty and shit. I've got off-road tyres on it and it's just meant for that. That little M4 is great for sort of like cruising. Oh yeah. <laughs> I know it really pisses dogs off this scooter. These tyres really, really do help with this type of shit. Give me a bit more confidence. Brakes are still working well on this, but we're only 23 miles in. I don't feel like I've got a need for high, semi hydraulics yet, or hydraulics. Turn to 20 miles an hour and locks up front and the back wheel. This is great and all. But my fingers are freaking killing me. See, look at that sculpture. That's really nice. Don't climb that because you will chop your nuts off. Nearly came off there. Thank you. Is that a seat? Yes, that's a seat. I tell you what, these tyres don't have to make a racket on the pavement. But it does sound, it kind of enhances the motor sound if you like. Oh god, so why so many people coming down here now? Look. I swear you see more people out now than there ever was before. I'm going to take this on the road now and uh, show you what these tyres sound like. Can you 
hear that? Look at me like I'm an idiot on this as well. Some people smile. Sorry about my runny nose, guys. I can't help it. I bought a new helmet, which uh, is a bit more enclosed. I haven't set it up yet because I need to mount this uh, mic adapter. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it. It's a brewer rock, which will make me look even more like a fucking bad end. So I make stickers and stuff in my spare time. So I've made these sort of like gel overlays for the buttons. Done one for the Eco Turbo one as well. Just gives you an idea of what the buttons are. Right, you ain't got a clue on this really. What's in and what's out this i printed that just to give me a guide on what voltage because i don't use that battery gauge on there this is still saying it's full but 54.6 volts is 100 percent 50.7 which i'm on 50.2 is 75 percent and that's still telling me i've got a full battery so you know that's not accurate at all this weather's terrible like, i don't mind getting this thing a bit dirty but your hands are fucking freezing cold, it don't really make you want to come out. They go in dual motor. So, no, I do love this thing, but this new skewer that I've got is uh, yes, the acceleration on this is good, but that thing is i would probably say three times quicker in acceleration it's a 5600 watt scooter which i think it peaks at about 6000 3000 watts each motor cheers <laughs> Yeah, it's um it's a bit underwhelming the power on this I think. Especially with the amps are set at sort of like twelve, but I don't want to blow anything. You can make it go a lot quicker. But Thank you. This feels like deja vu, this, doesn't it? Just on a different scooter. <laughs> Cheers. See, it's doing that same thing what it did before. It's like the... What a bag of shit. It's still shit, isn't it? What are we on? 27 miles now. Put it in single. Right, now let's see if it'll do it again. There you go. No. It's just a bag of shit, isn't it? Like these controllers, what have they done with it? Why did they change something that worked? See this now, look. This dude is just making a racket. See, this is why you need to take them on nice long runs because you don't know. So I'm gonna have to stick new controllers in this, I know I am. Bear 
bear in mind this is a replacement and it's still doing this it's a piss take Oh well, is what it is. There's no messing around scooter now. If and when I get to finding out what this problem is, yeah, may stick the older GBS controllers in. Because they work, don't they? You know, these newer ones don't. Or well, they don't last no more than 20 miles until they start fucking up. What have I done? 27 miles now. That's stupid like the last one what was that that i mean that was uh, they both played up from the start but then they just get progressively worse right so you've got to think now at the minute i mean gear three that's full throttle single motor i don't put it in fucking dual so I don't really fancy pushing it all the way back in case it does completely go pop Bag of shit, mate. Bag of shit. It's probably likely they've just sold a fucking batch to them like this. What are the chances of me getting two of them? Like that. What the hell is wrong with it? It's like a... It's like a MOSFET sort of like flicking on and off, I don't know. That's what it feels like. There we go, back to full performance again. Fuck me, I don't know what's wrong with it. But it's going like fucking shit now. It's doing exactly what it did before. But you got to bear in mind, this is a completely different scooter. Completely different. Well, not completely different. It's the same scooter, it's just... Not the same scooter. <laughs> Well, no, you know, I've put new stuff on this, so really in my best interest to get it sorted in it, get it working properly. Because I know I'm not the only one with this issue. Cheers. On your right, mate. <laughs> yeah, he was not aware I was there. So would e bikes though, wouldn't they? Well, e bikes are powered though, aren't they? So you have to put, you have to physically pedal, whereas these they're not pedal. So again, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not picking you up on it, right? So don't, don't read into that. I'm saying, just be aware of it. So if someone stops you, then, then you're aware. Sorry, mate. It's, then you're aware of it. It's just, you know, to be informed of something. It's better than to walk around. Yeah. Then, you, know, uh, you know, there's a lady here during the summer months. Done the same thing. I said, just be aware. 
He said, well, I didn't know that. I said, well, you carry on if you want to carry on. It's not for me. I'm not. I'm not the yeah. Just people just do what they feel is right. Yeah. So if someone then starts giving you grief, you can then say, like, I'm aware of the law, mate, and I know yeah. I'm, uh, I'm allowed to come down here. So I know, for instance, if you rent one. Yeah. It's different. So when you they it, don't have no rental schemes around here at all. No, you know, it's kind of a bit unfair, isn't it? But like, if you're like us, we just like to be aware of things, and then you take action based on information. Yeah. I know what the laws are on them. That's fine. Um, yeah. But it's a risk I take, I suppose, isn't it? If people are there, I slow down, give them a wide berth, and there's yeah, no... Yeah. That's it, that's it, there's no... That's why I say it. this is not a, a rant. It, I'm, it, yeah, we, we don't care no. what you want to yeah. do is we don't ever think yeah. we're yeah. just some people like to know things, and that's then it. they can either carry on and yeah. do That's it, yeah. At the end of the day, I'm just out for some fun. That's... Uh, and, you know, I'm not here to cause anyone else any grief. I don't want to put anyone else in danger and... I, I do think it's a silly law, yeah. if I'm honest, um, you know, because yeah, yeah, yeah. you, if you look at America and everywhere else, yeah. it's legal everywhere. Yeah. Um, there's speed limits in place for them. Remember, that law that's there is 1953. It is. And also, it's also for motorised, you know, as in uh, petrol or diesel type things, so it stops those coming down here with tractors and those ones. When you've got batteries now, it's a different technology. It is. It's not. It's yeah. Dated, um, law. So uh, yeah, I, I, we don't have a problem. With that. It's, it's got. A, it's got some way. I know you probably disagree with this. It's got some way benefit the government. I think the reason they don't like these is because they can't. They can't regulate them at the minute, and they they can't get any money from them. Yeah. Unless there's a way of taxing you, uh, they're not interested. Again. We'll just be aware if we see you on here around summertime on that, mate, and the and the um the lockdown is, is finished, I'll probably say, let's have a go on your little scooter, and I'll probably be hassling. To be fair, when you we saw you coming through, you purchased anyhow, you said coming through or whatever. So uh, I think as long as people like you are around, you don't need necessarily. You can just shout and say, look, I'm coming through or whatever. Yeah, you know, we have that's it. Else, but we tend to say, look, cyclists behind. You. I will wait patiently until someone notices me behind. I won't. A lot of the time, I won't even beep anyway because it's not you don't want to be and, and i know you're not just saying that because you did further on you waited behind us we waited for when we didn't tell us you and yeah. So, yeah all right thank you very much you take care and have a nice day yeah, see you later, see you later. <laughs> that was friendly enough i was getting ready <laughs> I was getting ready, but he turned it out to be quite nice and just basically he wanted a chat. That's what he wanted. Yeah, that noise now. She finished off with an endo. Way. Right, well that's the video boys. I'll see you in the next one. It'll be a week's time. Possibly too.